Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Anne and I have a business called Treasured Memories by Anne. In this video, I'm sharing some exciting news. I have been wanting an embroidery machine for a very, very long time and I have now been able to buy one. So if you like this sort of content, please remember to give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's take a look at the embroidery machine that I bought and the first project that I made with it. So here it is. I purchased the Brother PE535 embroidery machine. I got it off of Amazon. It comes with a 4x4 embroidery field. It has a touch screen which includes some pre-programmed letters as well as a few um, objects such as hearts and squares. In addition, I purchased separately stabilizer. I purchased tearaway stabilizer, poly mesh stabilizer, as well as cutaway stabilizer. Depending on the garment you're embroidering, it calls for a different type of stabilizer. Also, I purchased this new row thread, which I bought from Amazon, came in a kit with many choices of color. I also purchased some bobbin thread. Now let's take a look at our first project. I'm going to be making a personalized pencil case. So what I'm doing here is I'm adding the stabilizer to the 4x4 hoop that comes with the embroidery machine. You want to ensure that the stabilizer doesn't have any wrinkles and it's snugly into the hoop. The embroidery hoop comes with a grid which helps you to mark the center of the embroidery field. For the pencil case, I'm going to be turning it inside out and finding the center. And that's to place it on top of the stabilizer, matching the center of the embroidery field with the center of the pencil case. I'm going to be doing what they call the floating method. So instead of hooping the pencil case inside of the hoop, I'm going to be just pinning it to the stabilizer and have it float over top while it's embroidering. In order to design your embroidery designs, you need a software program. I use So What Pro. I've designed this name in So What Pro. I've saved it to a USB 
and I'm retrieving that design from the USB and it's going to get ready to embroider onto the pencil case. With this embroidery machine, it allows you to trace the design prior to doing the embroidery, just to make sure that it fits within the area of the item you're embroidering on. If it doesn't fit, the machine does allow you to move the design up and down or side to side so that you can get that perfect center without having to unhoop everything and position your garment, or in this case, the pencil case. And there you have it, a personalized pencil case for Shaw Day. All I need to do is go through and cut where you see those strings. You just cut those strings, which they call jump stitches. And this is ready to be packaged and sent to the special little girl. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more tutorials on the embroidery machine. Don't forget to give this video a like. See you in the next one.